Right then everyone, just stop back there and get my hat on. Um, just me clothing. I've taken the breast one off for a minute. I think, where's it gone? Uh, I probably will put it back on. It does help actually. But I need a bigger one. I actually need a bigger size. Every time you take your bag off, it takes 10 minutes to get it balanced again. Right, here we go. Like I say, every time you take your bag off, you have to readjust the straps. You add it nice and comfortable, and then you, you need something out of the rucksack. And I need the hat, and I'm glad I found it. I knew I'd need it for today. But look at this beautiful view, everyone. Look at this beautiful view. Now that young couple I saw, I bet they're even up, up, up the top there. Um, up the top there, there's a, like a hut. You can't see the hut from hit this angle, but there's a big aerial. And there's a hut on there. Around the corner of the four, the four land point is um, a lighthouse. I saw bits of it yesterday. This is the Southwest Coastal Walk. Um, I've done a lot of it. Somerset, I've, I've, I can actually say now, well, I've actually done the whole, by the time I get to County Gate, I know in Devon, yeah, no, I've actually done the whole of Somerset, actually. And I've just gone over the border now. Um, last in September I just touched the border with Devon and now I'm actually in um, Devon it still feels like Somerset to me Devon and Somerset are very close um, I think we're closer really than they say Devon and Cornwall but you've got a river a big river separating them too but it's all the southwest Somerset, Devon and Cornwall now, Wessex, they would also include Dorset, Wiltshire, and possibly Gloucester. Right, you've got to let that out again, Sean. A bit tight after your breakfast. It's a bit tight. Right, let me go back to... Back to Lymouth. Look, there's a reference point in that. Hotel on the hill there. See, there's a reference point for Lymouth. I'm so glad I'm doing this. I'm so glad the weather's turned out well. I mean, I have packed a light coat. It's just in case I get cold later. For some reason, we're very late. I've got a scarf and gloves as well, because I see them as first aid kit, to be quite honest. I mean, I haven't brought the waterproofs. To think I was going to bring another pair of shoes, thank God I didn't. I practice a lot at home, carrying the stuff around, loading it thousands of times to try and work out the weight on a budget. I will gradually add, because I still want to do some camping where I, where I can walk to. I can see them. There's so different ones. I can see the... No, they've just gone out of view now. It might not have been there, might have been another lot. Some people probably cheat and get a lift up the hill. There's probably a parking space there. I bet you anything, some people don't do the whole hike. You can't blame people. If people just want to do the top bit, why hike up here all the time? This is perfect. I shall remember this day for the rest of my life. This moment in time I'm enjoying, surrounded by beautiful green ferns and wild grasses and flowers and absolute magnificent scenery. Now, I don't reckon that's them because that, somebody had a white t shirt on. 
Look there. Zoom in. Probably just spear can. Look. Where are they gone? Is that them? No. Oh. Yeah, God, he's looking tired already. He's having to sit down, look. I think he's struggling. Yeah, I think he's struggling. I'd say I like, this is why I walk alone. Because it's like a reflective journey, journal for me. Um, walking with others is not a, at all the same. Although it's okay walking with others. Uh, there's nothing wrong with walking with others. <sighs> Where's that boat gone? I've just seen it. Little fisher boat there, I spat. Let's have a look. Yeah. Could be one boat on it. Could be two. Gentle waters, but perilous as well. That's the Bristol Channel that we're seeing there. Over to Wells, up to Bristol, up to Weston, out to the Atlantic. Now, although both my, as I've said on other videos, if people follow me, but just a reminder, over the past, well, a long, long time, 500 years plus, I haven't been, there are sections of my family that have been down here, but basically, I haven't, my, my family are from London, Cambridgeshire, Kent. Those are the main areas. We're very East Anglian. Very Anglo-Saxon. With Viking mixed in. So, uh, but I have traced down here. We're through Alfred the Great. I have traced us that far. It might sound far-fetched, but a thousand years is nothing. A thousand years plus, just over, is nothing. When you look at fossils and things like that, billions of years old. They still stopped. I don't want to walk with anyone. See, I like walking alone. This is a hike. I'm going to be turning off, folks. Just take some photos. They'll level off in a minute when we get up there. Over and out. Right, everyone. I'm going, I've just come up from right down there. It has been a big steady climb. A little path. Not the road, but a path been quite a hike actually. Um, I'm getting there, I've only got to get up to that road where those people are going. Um, so I thought I'd just video a bit. There's someone coming this way. There's Lynmouth down there, Linton up on the top. The rocks places that I've seen, Valley of Rocks is the other side of the hill, which I did yesterday afternoon and evening. I'm now walking on, keeping an eye on those people. Um, yeah, I think I can see a path where they'll probably go. There is somebody coming. But I thought, just do a bit of video here so that people can see, you know, like, Foreland area, Foreland Point, whatever it's called, is uh, getting closer. And I can see that it go, there's a path goes round, but I don't know in relation where the church is. That's the only problem I've got there. The idea is to get to the church, and then we're worried we might have to branch off. This is where you've got to be very careful. It's very narrow here, and very slippery, and very steep down. Look. You wouldn't stand much chance if somebody pushed you there. And there, can I see somebody? Thought I saw somebody then. Oh no, it's just a parking sign. Gradient of 11%. So I've just come up there, look. 
from down right down there so it's been a steady climb and we're still climbing and there's somebody coming somebody coming I'll turn it off in a sec never know when I got it on zoom there's the acorn sign there Over and out. <laughs> 